Hey my girls, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Taj and I'm a paycheck budgeter by documenting my financial journey here on YouTube. If you are returning, welcome back beautiful budgeter. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a paycheck budget. So if you are interested in seeing how I budget my paychecks, then stick around my girl and keep on watching. Get out the way, who got a watch, who got the time, I'm raising the clock Even in my feelings, grind don't stop, got big dreams, one big rocks I got plans, who got talk Alright, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back So we're going to be doing our paycheck budget for this week Um, Just as a recap um, for last week, I did go in, um, I usually go, um, like a couple of days after my paycheck, um, and after I've like made my, all paid all my bills and everything, um, online, I like to go back in and kind of check to see what is, has already cleared. Um, it doesn't bother me if something has not cleared yet because I have a separate account that I use just to pay my bills out of just so that those type of things don't happen where I'm swiping my card or I'm pulling money and I'm assuming that something came out and it didn't. So all of my bills are paid out of my bill account. Um, and so I don't use that account for anything other than paying bills. So anything that I do swipe my car, end up swiping my car for, I know that I am not kind of going into any type of bill money. Um, but I do like to still keep on top of it and go in to see if, um, anything has, you know, if everything has cleared out of the account. And so that's what these checks mark check marks were. Um, I actually went in to kind of make sure that everything had cleared or went, you know, what was still lingering. And so far everything has been, um, taken out. So, uh, so that midweek check-in went okay. Um, and yeah, that was it. So we're going to go ahead and jump into this week's budget. So this is going to be for, um, my week starts on a Thursday. So this is going to be September 26th. All right. And so this week we only have, um, Okay, so let's see. Technically, we have two incomes, but not. <laughs> so if you watch my previous video, well, I don't know which video going to come out first, girl, but I did get paid from YouTube, but I didn't count that with this um, because I cashed stuff that different. So I am going to, I don't think I'm going to include that because it because I've already done, you know, I've already allocated that. Um, but we're going to budget for, um, 17, 16 this week. Um, and then extra income. So extra income for this week is not what extra income normally is. The extra income that I'm putting here, um, is actually, um, um, what do you call it? Rollover in the bill account. Um, so that is going to be rollover that my husband had ended up giving me to allocate over, but I ended up not needing it. And then instead of just giving it back, girl, I left it in there. So, <laughs> um, so that's what that is. So let me get my calculator out. All right. So we are going to be Hopefully, we'll be working with 17, 16, plus 130, so 1846. All right, so this week, all right, my bad job. So this week, uh, we're going to put up mortgage, and that's going to be 700. Um, Jeff Davis. So last week we put half up for Jeff Davis. And then this week is going to be the other half because it's actually due. Um, and so that's going to be two thirteen seventy. Um, there is a fee to pay it. And I don't remember 
I'm gonna say three ninety five, but I don't know. So I'm gonna say two two thirteen seventy plus three ninety five. Let's see. Let's say two seventeen sixty five. That's what we're gonna budget for. Two seventeen sixty five. Cause them cows they want to charge a fee to pay it online. You're already high. And then you want to charge a fee to pay it online. Um, Ron's line of credit that is going to be paid. So that's two fifty. Um, LCP is sixty five fifty, and then the AT and T. This is the phones. And I always do that one in half, but this is actually, I should have, or this should have been the second half, but girl, it's only, it's the first half. It is what it is, child. Um, all right. So that's it for this week. All right, so we have mortgage. Um, my mortgage is two forty three ninety six, I think. Um, but of course, I break that up, um, and so I just keep. I put seven hundred. I break it up in threes, and I put seven hundred to the side um, in the bill account to pay my mortgage when it's time to pay it. Um. So you're gonna pretty much always see this. Um Jeff Davis, we paid half last week, and so we're gonna pay this two seventeen sixty five this week. It's actually two thirteen seventy, but I think the fee is three ninety five. But I, I also think that is dep it depends on how much it is. Cause I remember one time paying it in full and it was way more than three ninety five. So I think it has something to do with the how much you're paying determines what the fee is to pay it online. But I think for this amount it's gonna be three ninety five. But we'll see. Um elastic is Ron's line of credit and then L C P is sixty five fifty. AT and T phones is one thirty five seventeen. It's actually two sixty something but I um or two seventy but I break it up in two. So let's see how much that is. So we have, y'all know I'm right-handed. All right, so we have uh, 700, 217, 65, 250, 65, 50, and 135, 17. So that's 13, 68, 32. All right, minus 1846. So that will leave 477.68. Okay. All right. <laughs> um, Y'all know I be, I second guess myself all the time when you come down to this calculator. 700, 217, 65, 250, 65, 50, and 135.17. I ain't gonna lie. I was, I was like, I was trying not to have to do it again, but y'all, y'all know how I am with this calculator. And I was sitting here like, should I do it again or should I just trust my fingers the first time? But girl, I couldn't do it. Um, so, okay. So we write 13, 68, 32. And then um, 1846 minus 136832, and we're left with 47768. So, girl, the fingers was fingering, okay, this time, but we just we can't we can't trust them, okay. Um, so then we're going to um go into my cash envelopes. So usually I'm doing gas, groceries. Um, household, uh, miscellaneous, what else is in my wallet? Eat out and beauty. 
All right. Um, I got, I'm going to put 30. Let me see, 30. Mm. I better come back to this. Let me go over here. So one, two. Um, I usually like to do that with what I have left, but I'm really trying to aggressively tackle this debt um, to get it back down because I was doing so good, y'all. When I say I was doing so good, and I don't know what happened. It could have been a scheme that Todd set up for him to come to you with the booze. I don't know, but girl, I got to get it back to where it was. So I need to do an update on that too. Um, a debt update. Um, so let's see, Ron, he has a credit one call. He doesn't have a balance, but there is a membership fee. I did look it up this morning. It was 844 is the fee. Um, my Amex is 40. Nothing is due on the Amex card, but I'm going to put $40 there. And then Amazon card, I'm going to put $50. Cause girl, I ain't got some stuff on Amazon. Y'all and yeah. Okay. Whatever. <laughs> um, y'all, I bought that book. It, it, if you know, you know, okay. Oh, uh, I ain't care nothing about what they talk about. Some is discredited and it ain't it ain't been verified, baby. I'm, I'm I needed to know because I want to know if my suspicions since the nine nine two thousands has been correct. Okay. Oh, uh, so yeah, your girl bought the book. Okay. Oh, uh, and for those of you that know, you know. Um, <laughs> along with some other stuff I had bought off of Amazon. Um, and I think that's it. So let me add that up. So 844, 40, and 50. So that is 9844. All right. So let me just do it here. 9844. And that's going to leave me with, let me see, 477, 68 minus 9844. So that's gonna leave me with three seventy nine twenty four. Okay, okay, okay. All right. Make sure, cause that looks so good to be true. Um. So we got that. We got that. Make sure I ain't forgetting about nothing. All right. Um. So that's right. Okay. Four seventy seven. 68 minus 9844 379.24. Okay. All right. Let's go to uh, my cash envelopes. And Let's see. So we're going to do 30. So minus 30. All right. That leaves one, I mean, 349.24. Um, I made a grocery list, y'all. I did a, I did a, um, I plan, I did a meal, plan meals. So, um, let's see. According to, my meal plan and my grocery list. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say 160 should do me. All right, minus 160. All right, household, baby, we definitely need to. So we're gonna do 50. So that's 139. And then we can do, I'll put something in. Let me, I'm going to come back. 139, I'm going to go with my sinking funds. 
and I'm gonna see extra mortgage. So I have a list here um, of the sinking funds that I haven't really been, that I need to like put something in. I may not be able to, you know, do what I want, but I want to be able to try, try and do a little something, something. I'm learning that every little bit counts. Um, I'm, I'm definitely getting out of the mindset thinking that um, if I don't do large amounts put to the side that I'm doing something. Um, I think that's what my issue was trying and, and that was making me overdo it and um, putting too much of a heavy load on myself and then ended end up having to go back and dip in. Um, but, you know, learning to do little by little is allowing me to accumulate, but not have to go back into it, you know, as often as I was. Um, so um, we're going to do uh, 25 and then, so minus 25. All right, and then pills and potion. Ever since school started, Desire, my youngest one, has been keep getting cold, getting sick. My oldest one, who was in college, she then got sick twice. Um, yeah, I don't know what's gonna do. The whole summer, ain't nobody get sick. But if school started back, mm. so we're gonna put ten dollars in there. School days. We're going to do $5. So wait, minus 10, minus 5, 99, 24. All right, we're getting down. Um, King. I'm going to do $10. So minus 10. Uh, car maintenance. I really need to get this up. Uh, I'm going to do 10. I'm going to still put Broke Besties, but y'all know I got rid of that envelope. And I just made individuals. Um, so that's 10. And I'm going to stop right there. Because I I want to... Okay, so I was thinking about erasing this and put this in my emergency fund. But I did stuff it when I got my YouTube payout. So I'm not going to stress about it. Um, so I'm going to leave it as it is. I also had put something in, the, in, in my... Um, beauty um, envelope. Miscellaneous, I think what I'm going to do is if I have anything left over from my cash envelopes, I'll put it in the miscellaneous. I don't want to stuff that because I want to kind of leave a buffer in where it's 69.24 and I like to leave something in there. Um, I'm a zero base, but not a zero base because whatever I leave in there is, is I consider it as a buffer. I just don't like to zero zero it out because you just never know, girl. And I'm, a, I'm afraid. I ain't gonna lie. I'm afraid to do that. So, um, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a stop here. Eating out. Um, I am going to try my best. Listen, y'all, I work from home. So... Um, I do save when it comes down to gas. I don't ride, drive as much like I used to, but I've definitely, because how I work, I work 10 hours a day. And so a lot of times I'm eating out because one, by the time I get off, it's too late for me to cook. Two, um, I can't really cook while I'm at work, even though I'm at home because my job requires me to be on the phone pretty much 24 seven. Um, and 
So it's just, you know, unless I'm doing like a crock pot meal. Um, so a lot of times I find myself eating out um, or my lunch, which is not that long and it goes by so fast. I may run to somewhere close to get something to eat if I haven't, if I don't really have anything in the house that I want. Um, I am going to start doing better when it comes down to that because I am spending way too much money. I was looking at my transaction um, where I was swiping my card. Y'all know on my um, expense tracker, I only the only thing that I really put on there is when I'm swiping my card unexpectedly. And I was looking at it um, and a lot of this could be avoided, but a lot of it was food. Um, and I'm just getting tired of eating out. I want to be, I don't like cooking, but I, I would rather, I, I'm just getting tired. To be honest, I'm getting tired of eating out. Um, and when I eat out, it, it's going to cost because it's not just me. So, you know, the kids come home from school, they be hungry. By the time I get off of work, you know, most of the time it's about seven, between seven thirty, between seven and eight o'clock. Um, they hungry, they figuring, mama, you cooking? Girl, if I was to try to cook, girl, y'all gonna be asleep. So I would just end up going and get something for us to eat. And honestly, the only time, girl, we eating dinner is when my husband home because he let it cook. And while I'm at work, he be in the kitchen, okay? Um, but yeah, I gotta I gotta stop that. So I'm 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 taking the time out to meal plan like I used to, and hopefully that'll help. Um, but let me tell you what has not been helping. Every time, and this this is frustrating for me, and I had to go off on my kids because, baby, listen, for though I don't get food stamps, okay? Baby, I wish I did, okay? But I don't. And so I can't keep up with y'all greedy behinds. Every time I put something in here, like I'll go to the store, because they always saying, we ain't got nothing to snack on. We ain't got nothing to snack on. Baby, we ain't got nothing to snack on because y'all y'all humbuggish. Every time I put something in here, y'all like vultures. Like, I literally will go buy, like, cookies and things like that just to be able to snack on if you get a little sweet to here and there, whatever. But, girl, I'm telling you, I will go buy it today and tomorrow it's gone. Like, tonight, I, you would, I would get off work and, girl, the, the pack in the, in the trash. I will buy a little pop sauce for like, you know, in the morning time when they get ready to leave to go to school. They may be running late a little bit, so they might grab a pop sauce. No, baby, they like the pop sauce so much that by the time the next morning comes, they ain't got no pop sauce. Y'all know they ain't got that many in the box. Why is y'all eating up everything so damn fast? I cannot keep up with y'all. So then y'all looking upside my head, talking about something. Why we ain't got no food? We ain't got nothing in here because you ate it all. I'm not finna keep going back and forth to the stove. So either you make it work or you just gonna be in this starving, okay? Cause I'm going in the store with a list and I'm checking it twice. But I'm not I'm not finna keep going back into the back to the store every single day or every other day because y'all wanna be drinking up all the drinks and drink some damn water. Then you go, then then you you open the drinks. I got four or five drinks, open drinks. That's in the refrigerator and nobody don't know who they for. That ain't mine. Or you left it on the table. I ain't, that's not mine. Well, who is it for? Y'all got all these open drinks. And nobody ain't drinking them all. Or a 50 million open half drunk bottles of water. You know what I do? Okay, y'all want to play? Since nobody don't want to say, baby, I'll open them bottle of waters and be pouring them. <laughs> pouring them in it and tighten it up and baby, bam. Or when I fix dinner and I go, whoever, I don't care who drink it is. I'm pouring it in a cup with some ice. There you go. Y'all gonna, y'all gonna drink these drinks. Stop opening up them drinks if you're not gonna drink them all. Drink you some damn water. Get your little glass and get you some water out the filter refrigerator. refrigerator. Well, we say refrigerator, but you know, you know, y'all know what I mean. Because obviously you're not gonna drink that whole bottle of water. Girl, I get sick and tired of fussing with them. Okay, that's my rant on my kids. <laughs> um, but yeah, girl, that be driving me crazy. Then, then I go and look 
Y'all done went through all, all the little snacks that I done put in here. Y'all done went through them. Then when I ate, well, who ate all this? I don't know, because I only had two. Oh, Because I ain't even getting none. So you mean to tell me these damn cookies, these shit, they just walked the hell up out this house and said, I don't want to be here no more? Somebody ate them. Nobody don't know who ate them. I, I only had one. Girl, bye. Um... Girl, done pissed me off. I done forgot where I was. Shit. <laughs> Girl, them, them kids, baby. That's why my hair is great. I got more gray now. Every time I go get a retwist on my locks, baby, I find more and more gray here. Shit. All right, y'all. So, we gonna roll like this. Um... I don't think I'm going to stuff eating out because I'm trying my best not to eat out. So let's go ahead and add and see, add up what we got. So we have 30, 160, and 50 here. So that's going to be 240. And then uh, we have, okay, so 240. All right, so let's see, 379. This is because we went from here to here. So 379, 24. Minus 240. That's going to leave me with 139.24. And then let me add this up. So that's 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 70. Girl, let me not show off. Let me see. 25, 10, 5, 10. All right, 70. All right, so 139. So we went from here to here. So four. All right, so 139, 24 minus 70. That's going to leave me with 69, 24. And then I'm just not going to... Uh, do anything here this week this time because i did stuff uh with my youtube paycheck so we're going to hopefully have um 6924 remainder all right and then as far as uh total cash to withdraw we're going to do 240 plus 70, and that's $310. All right. So that's what we're looking at. Um, I'm going to wait to do the um, breakdown for the cash envelopes. You guys know that I wait until I'm actually doing my actuals um, before I do that because sometimes this number will change. Things will change. So, you know, even though I write with erasable ink, I just kind of wait. Um, but yeah, y'all, that's the budget for this week. Um, it really, I sat down and I kind of did a kind of budget overview on how and just kind of write down some strategies on how to get everything back on track. Um and honestly, it had me stressed out, but it is what it is. I'm just going, I'm just rolling with the punches, y'all. Um, we human, things, things happen. Y'all know my channel. I'm real deal, holy feel. I'm not, it, it just is what it is for me. Um, and I'm, I'm honestly thinking that, um, I'm hoping that I have everything on track before the year is out. Um, because I don't want to be, I don't want, I don't want to say it. I don't want to put that out there into the atmosphere, but it's like, I don't want to be relying on taxes in order to get me back on track. I want that to be an, an addition. And so I'm trying to work really hard to budget and get things back on track so that I don't let this setback linger until the end of the year. If it does, it does. Um, but I'm just, I'm just saying I'm trying my best to be able to get on top of everything so that the end of the year can be an addition to me and not just make it having me break even. Oh, really quickly. Um, I did go ahead and finish out 
my for those of you that are channel members i did go ahead and finish out my spread for or what i'm going to use for my spread for the month of october it's going to pretty much be neutral um the theme is coming from the actual uh cover of my journal um because i just love this so much um so that is what the theme is going to be um I did go ahead and finish it out. Um, I just haven't done my spread yet. I used to do videos with showing you me doing my spread. Those didn't really get as much of a view. So I really, I just kind of stopped doing them. I did go ahead and print some of mine's. I didn't use my Cricut this time. Um, and I used different paper for different things. So like my Planner Girls, I used a clear um she um i'm trying out a, a different way with my stickers so usually i just do like my boxes but i also try something different so you'll see that um and that's just usually like a little personal what you call it for me um also the uh days of the week for the most part this is um the spread for the month of october it's going to be pretty neutral so all right y'all that is it for this video if you like this video if you like my channel please give me a thumbs up also don't forget to subscribe hit that notification bell so that you can be notified each and every time i upload and i will see you beauties in the next video okay my girls bye